my name is Jennifer and welcome back to my channel. So if you have been around for a minute, you will know that last June, June 2017, I was got LASIK surgery and a lot of you are watching the video still asking me questions which I love. So I figured I would jump on and do a quick update on the healing process and where I am now that it's been a year after LASIK. So I'm going to just cut to the chase and then rewind. Uh, I went to see an eye doctor the last week and he was basically just really impressed with how my eyes have turned out after LASIK. And if you recall, right after LASIK, they make you go back for a quick appointment the day after just to make sure everything's healing correctly. At that point in time, I was a 2015 in my vision, so better than 2020. And at my eye appointment last week, I was still measuring 2015, so I'm still seeing better than 2020, which is absolutely awesome. I had really bad astigmatism before I got LASIK and I needed like really bad toric lenses that were really expensive and I so I asked him I'm like did they fix my astigmatism because that that was what I couldn't see myself and he was like yeah your astigmatism was really bad but they fixed it hundred percent in one eye and then the other eye and I don't remember which one it was um, I have just a little bit of astigmatism left so about 0.25 he said he's barely able to even measure it so very impressed I'm very happy with my results and I am now able to wear colored contacts actually so you might be able to notice that I'm wearing like these light brown uh, colored contacts which I'm gonna make a whole separate video for but anyway, let's go back to the healing process. So after the surgery, at least my doctor at LASIK Plus gave me a, by the way, this video is like not sponsored, even though I love my results, it's not sponsored. Um, the eye doctor will give you a, a two bottles of eye drops. One is an anti-inflammatory, one is an antibacterial, and they'll give you like a bunch of other supplements. Um, I will admit that I like didn't really take the supplements, but I definitely, followed the instructions to my eye drops to a T. Like, do not skip on your eye drops, especially the prescription ones, because you need them. And on top of all those, um, especially like once I ran out, I was using like re-wetting drops. I would say I probably started three times a day and then went down to two, then once a day. Um, now I don't use eye drops at all, actually. And the eye drops that I was using was these like little blink tears eye drops. I have both the regular kind and the gel tears kind. The gel tears kind is nice for like right when you go to bed, put them in and then in the morning they won't feel quite as dry. For me, during the recovery process, my eyes were definitely the driest in the morning. Like the minute I wake up, it's just like so hard to peel my eyelids off of my eyes because of how dry they were um, just a few months after the surgery and so the gel tears really helped with that. I would say now that it's been a year, I do get dry every once in a while. I would say maybe once a week I would wake up and it would be slightly uncomfortable, but it wouldn't be as miserable as it was before. And so I would just do a quick round of eye drops in the morning before I go, or even if I leave it alone, it usually fixes itself in a couple hours. And I basically live life like normal now, like eye drop free, pain free, like it. I don't even notice that, you know, my eyes have been cut open and lasered basically. A big question that I think people have been asking is about starbursts and halos at night. Uh, right after you get LASIK I was noticing pretty bad starbursts and halos especially at night with really bright lights so like oncoming traffic, their headlights or street lamps and stuff like that would have halos and starbursts. I would say it has gotten a lot better in the last year but it is not 100% gone. Like it is not like gone to the point where like it was before LASIK and at this point I don't think it will ever get to that point. So I still have a little bit of residual starbursts and halos left, but it is not enough to bug me on a daily basis. I honestly didn't even notice it until like a couple days before making this video. I was planning it out and I was like, are you still seeing starbursts? And I actually had to like focus late at night when I was driving and be like, yeah, I guess I am still seeing a little bit. So not a big deal at all. Um, I'm not disappointed that I got the surgery. I This is like, the best it could have gone, honestly. So all in all, I am very happy about that. So I would say if you did get LASIK and you're on the recovery road, just be patient with yourself because everybody heals at a different pace. And so don't feel like, oh my gosh, it's been three months and I'm still using eye drops. Like, are, is something wrong with my eyes? No, there isn't. Just like keep doing what you're doing. Give your eyes time to heal. Honestly, like the first six months I could, I could feel like and see a really big difference with the healing. And then past six months, it was kind of like, 
okay, I think I'm pretty stable now. Um, and I don't think my eyes are going to change all that much now moving forward. I think I am totally healed, as at least that's what my optometrist tells me. But yeah, this is meant to be a super quick update. So let me know if you guys have any questions about my experience. I'm obviously not a medical professional, so don't ask me like anything that you would actually have to go to the doctor for. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this update and I hope you guys subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you next time. Bye!